Today we're here in Gatlinburg, Tennessee, and we're gonna head into Ripley's Aquarium of the Smokies. You ready, Dawn? I'm ready. Let's, Let's do, do this. It. And it's been a while since we've been here, I'd say at least a year so we're gonna go in there and see if there's anything new we're excited now i know we've done lots of videos in here it's probably like a tenth time we've done a video in here but maybe something has changed in the last year and um i don't know i love aquariums so we're gonna head on in They have new extended hours, Monday through Thursday from 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. and Friday through Sunday until 10 p.m. So they have some new fall decor out here and they have this thing called How Tall This Fall. You can measure your height. So folks are always asking us, how tall are you? Because on camera, it doesn't really give you a good indication. And here you're about, what, five and a half foot tall? Eh, about five and a half there. So now we're going to look at see how tall Will is. It looks like you're six foot. <laughs> Pretty close to six foot. Yes. Yeah. Now you guys know how tall we are. I'm six foot. Don's five five. And today we're going to use the ultimate fun pass. As soon as you walk in, you're greeted with this huge tank. Oh, wow. There's all kinds of really cool tropical fish. I think that's a parrotfish, maybe? Yeah. Wow. So over here you have a Davy Jones I think he's made out of like car parts like here is like it looks like like some kind of like sprayer nozzles or something and there's a chain to like a bike Dawn he's got a huge finger I think it's spear finger so you got Davy Jones and this is Captain Jack Sparrow His eyes are creepy. yeah of course he's made out of more like yeah like motorcycle parts and yeah cool cool and there's nothing like the aquarium now there's i believe there's what two levels there's a the first floor and then you have the basement floor and both floors have all kinds of cool fish tanks of course they're known for their sharks or yeah they have a shark tank here oh i bet you there's a mermaid that lives here this is her little house, and that must be her, her clamshell she lives in, right? And we're gonna head into the tropical rainforest. These guys are called red hooks. Also, there's a little angel fish in there, the same type you would find in your fish tank at home. Oh, there is, there's a couple of them. Yeah. So they call these the red-bellied piranhas. You definitely do not want to stick your hand in this tank. They're a lot bigger than you think they would be. Yeah, a lot of movies are made about these guys and definitely do not want to be swimming around the Amazon. Huh. You can even see their little, their teeth don't look too bad. Not too bad. Ah, uh, and they call this guy an electric eel. Definitely do not want to touch him. You get electrocuted. I think he's just chilling out. Got a long body he does. Kind of like a, a water snake. And that's a poison dart frog. His little buddy's up there. It's a little bit greener than the one below him. You don't want to touch those guys, they're poisonous. And that guy's a mud skipper. And that guy was called a four-eyed fish. So now we're heading into the ocean 
round. Yeah, so this is a schooling fish. I guess these fish are going to school, right? They're too cool for school. They're too cool for school. Yeah, I think I think these guys are late. That's the reason why they're all Russian. Trying to get to school. We're in the drifter's tank, and this is the moon jellyfish. Oh wow, they look They look peaceful, don't they? Yeah. They look happy. Happy little jellyfish. I think we found the flounder. Oh yeah, that's a, you can see him, he kind of blends in. Look at his fins. I think a lot of people eat flounder. You ever heard yeah. of the fish flounder? I don't know if it's this kind of flounder, but. It almost looks like he can walk on water with his legs. Yeah. Kind of, yeah, he kind of got Doesn't like, he, he, he kind of got. like he's got legs. Oh yeah. <laughs> I yeah. never noticed it before. Yeah. Here he comes, Will. He's coming to bite you. Is he coming to bite me? Yeah, bite. <laughs> so these guys here are called garden eels. Using the rigid tips of their tails as they move up and down. Yeah, it's a little garden eel. I think he's waiting for something good to eat to swim by and then he'll he'll grab it. <laughs> yeah. The little eyes and all that. Yeah. That is a huge sea urchin in there. I don't know if you could see him back there, but he's he's a big one. Yeah. Oh wow, they're. This aquarium is a lot bigger on the inside than what it looks like on the outside. And there is plenty to do. I think this is the black tip shark tank. I'm not seeing all there's there Yeah, he's down in there. It's hard to see it though. Yeah, they're down in there. Black tips. But I believe there's a tunnel that goes. See the tunnel? You can see the tunnel. So we'll be able to see those guys from down there. Oh boy, is that a shark? It is. Yeah. He's a big boy. And you can see folks down in the tunnel below. There goes another one. Swimming that way. I know it's hard to make it out, but that's a barracuda, Don. I think so. Yeah, it is. He's just hanging out there. Probably looking for something good to eat. I might get fish bait. Ba -ba -ba barracuda. This is a great place to come. If it's raining outside or it's too hot, you can duck down in here. It's always cool in the fish tank. Okay. And uh, just a wonderful place, especially for kids. Kids will love this. Of course, I'm a kid. So I love it. Dawn, you're a kid. Yeah. And we love it. You enjoy the aquarium. <laughs> we do, we do. So that's it for the upper floor here. We're gonna head down to the lower level here and see the rest of the fish. And also, there is a shark tank down there. Oh boy. Very, very scary. I always take the Rambo, Rambo Bridge when I'm here at the aquarium. Rainbow Bridge, Rainbow Bridge. See the rainbow of colors. Rainbow Bridge. Rainbow Bridge. As we're going down, there's a waterfall. Ooh, the cichlids. We almost had some in our aquarium yeah. at one time. Yeah, we had some cichlids in our tank. They're kind of aggressive. They'll like 
beat up on each other and, and all that good like stuff. Pink and purple and red and I think gray and black. They're kind of a bluish color. There goes one. There's a bunch of them on the tank with the rocks. I think he wants out. The There's just too many of them in there. That's an Oscar. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. They're huge. They're big. I think they're getting too big for the tank. Now, these fish are the kind you'd find in your fish tank. But if you put them in a bigger tank, this is what you get. That's how big those guys can get. We're now heading to the coral reef. This is one of my favorite little places here where they keep the seahorses. These are the pot belly seahorse. Oh, I got some dive times. This is where they have their dive shows every hour or so. Yeah. Oh, there's so many different types of fish in there. It's a it's a big tank. I think those are parrot fish. Oh wow, so this is the weedy sea dragon. Oh, there's there's a whole mess of them in there. That is it's cool. So the part that we all been waiting for, the shark lagoon. It looks like the sharks have, well, ate a hole in the side of this ship. Let's head into the shark lagoon. So those are the black tip sharks. You don't want to mess with those guys. Yeah. Looks like they're having a good time, right? Mm -hmm. This chillin'. Is that a sawtooth? Occasional swimmer that swims by. Yep. Oh, Don, there's one creeping up on you there. Oh, there he goes. It's Jabberjaw. Uh. guys are pretty creepy they almost you almost feel like they're stalking you you know they're just waiting for you to decide to take a swim and they'll, they'll come and get you hmm. the, the scratches you see are the result of a shark attack 
don't know if you can see them, but those are the shark attack scratches right there. I think he's been following us the whole time. I think he does too. What is that shark got on my tail? I don't know. Definitely have a lot of teeth. I think he's missing something. And there's Mr. Grouper. <laughs> well, Mr. Grouper. And now we're heading into the Gallery of the Seas. You can see all the coral. Very beautiful coral. There's a clownfish up there getting busy. Uh -huh. So this guy is called the lionfish. And I heard they're an invasive species down in Florida. And um, they like folks to, to try to capture them. Somebody says they're good eating. But yeah, yeah. You don't want to step on one though. Or the scorpion fish. That, that would be bad too. And that's a that's a scorpion. Fish. Yep. Oh, he blends right in, doesn't he? Yeah. Here he comes. <laughs> oh, there's a, another lionfish. Whatever's lying around. Whatever's lying around, huh? <laughs> Look at him go. He's all majestic with his wings. His yeah. fins all opened. He's called wings. <laughs> oh wow! So they call these guys Pacific Sea. Nettles. Great big huge jellyfish. That's kind of seen the ocean. Kind of like we've seen down in um, Destin on the beach. I bet you they could do some damage. <laughs> oh wow. Yeah, they're quite amazing actually. It's the jellies. Oh, let's see if the Mr. Octopus is out. Well, that's a huge sea anemone right there. He's like suction cup to the glass, huh? It's gotta be real. Oh yeah, he, he's real. He's real. What's the blue thing? I don't know. But there's a starfish over here in the corner of the tank. Oh, it is. But we're looking for the octopus and he is so hard to find. That could be him right there. I don't know. You know, there's only been one time before where I saw the octopus. Every other time, I have never seen him. He's always hiding out. There he is. He's hiding. See him? His eyeballs. Oh, there's... You can barely see him, but there's the octopus there. He's he's hiding out. Yeah, he's up in there. Yeah, you can't really see him, but he's in there. And these guys are called the giant Japanese spider crabs. <laughs> They're huge. I mean, I don't know if you can stand next to them, but they're, they're, yeah, they're big. They are big. Hello, Mr. Spider Crab. There's a shrimp cocktail there. Oh, they're right there, Will. The little ones. The little guys. Oh, yeah, there's little, 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 little guys down here hiding out. They look like little cotton balls, don't they? Yeah, they do. Little, little cotton balls. Uh, I absolutely love these cuttlefish. Remember, there's a bunch of babies in here. I think they've they've all grown up now. I think there's just the one in there, isn't there? I think, yeah. So they call this the old wife fish. <laughs> They're kind of like angelfish, you know. I don't know. They got unique names for these guys, but that's what they call it. Uh, the old, the old wife. They're in the waters of Australia. Now we're gonna head into Curious Creatures Robert Ripley exhibit. 
Ripley wrestling a shark. <laughs> so this is one of their exhibit halls. They change it up. You know, they change it out quite often. This is a, it's an American lobster. It's real, it's moving. Yeah, it's the kind you eat. Oh. Yeah. This curious object was once exhibited as a genuine mermaid. Incredible as it may sound, thousands of people paid 25 cents in 1842 to see uh, P.T. Barnum's uh, Fiji Mermaid. Barnum insisted that the mermaid was genuine until his old age. He admitted that it's an fusing of an upper half of a monkey and a lower half of a fish. And there is a photo op for the kids. Just make sure they don't get eaten by the great big snake. <laughs> You've, you've taken that photo many yeah. of times, haven't you? Yeah. Will's in the giant snake. <laughs> so more of the aquarium continues this way. Oh, look at all the stingrays. Oh, little baby har hammerheads. <laughs> they look like they just, they're just flying around, don't they? So they have a little snack bar here called the Feeding Frenzy. They have Philly cheesesteaks, they have chicken fingers, uh, grilled cheese sandwich combos, uh, averaging about $13 uh, dollars plus tax. Oh, penguin love. <laughs> Yeah, I wonder where Derby's at. He's always raising trouble somewhere. And like always, exit through the gift shop. They've got a really big gift shop here with almost everything you can imagine. Uh, lots of different hoodies and t-shirts and and plush. Uh, it's pretty pretty big. They even got a stuffed penguin. Yeah. yeah. All kinds of crazy teas and so that was Ripley's Aquarium of the Smokies. Uh, it's, it's exactly the way I remember it the last time we were here. Did, nothing really changed, did it? No. But, uh, there's, but it's always great because, you know, the fish put on a different show every single time uh, you're there. Now, I always enjoy the aquarium. There's always so much to see and do. Yeah. And the sharks are always great to see. Uh, the penguins always put on a show. I didn't see Derby, though. didn't, I didn't see, see Derby. Derby. But he was, sure in there. he was in there. But... Yeah, he was in there somewhere. We didn't see Sally Sea Turtle either, but I'm sure she was in there somewhere. Yeah, she usually is. But folks, that's going to do it for today here in Gatlinburg. If you guys like this vlog, give it a thumbs up. Also, please subscribe if you haven't so you don't miss these upcoming Smoky Mountain Adventures. And until next time, thanks for watching. Bye, everyone. Bye.